Al Qaeda, ISIS, Islamist terror has spread, it has evolved, it has metastasized. And we are entering this new phase, certainly demonstrated by ISIS, where they are using social media in incredibly sophisticated, incredibly effective ways. New America did a study of 129 individuals in the United States who had um, either joined ISIS or tried to join ISIS. They were entirely radicalized online. We find content, this is what CEP is very good at. We determine it to be a violation of terms of service because it incites violence, it glorifies violence, or it shows gratuitous violence. Initially, the social media companies took the view, we're just a platform that's not our responsibility. We said that's an unacceptable answer. We locked arms with like-minded uh, elected officials and got hearings held. We realized that shining a light on this absurd view um, would help to bring them along. CEP has played a big role in just today. The Times, and I don't think it's entirely a coincidence, has an important story about Alauki and his presence on YouTube. What we are seeing is that public pressure Pressure from Capitol Hill, uh, pressure from the EU, and pressure from advertisers are what is going to take the day. CEP is bringing stakeholders together and building consensus around solutions to rid the internet of extremist content. Learn more at counterextremism.com.